What's going on everyone? This is Vangelis2019, back in No Man's Sky, and doing something a little bit different today. I realised that um, now that we finished the expedition, that things like giant eggs, which I think is meant to be there, um, are now available. So I, I'm going to try and mop up the last of these cooking products. So that I think is the giant eggs. That is going to be um, fiendish row. Then I also think Diplo Chunks, so either that's Diplo Chunks or that's Diplo Chunks. And then the Fiendish Row we need to, if I can find it, Haunted Pie. That's the only thing that's missing. So once I've got those four things done, I would have maxed out cooking products. So let's see if we can do it. So try as I might, I have failed to find uh, fiendish row anywhere but uh, fortunately for me Captain Steve published a video on exactly where to find fiendish row and I'm not uh, too proud to just yeah go straight there and get it so we need a method of getting a portal and we need that one cool beans already now what we need to do is create a save in case that map doesn't give us what we want. So we'll just hop in, hop out. Okay, that's created a save. Now if we use this map and we see what we get. Alien monolith detected. Fan dabby dozy. Off we pop. Alright, let's just do it. Thank you, sweet lady. Corvax entities escape slavery. Corvax echoes share this knowledge. Be free. Thank you, suit lady. Two stone blocks slowly revolve on the base of the monolith. Two beads of red light then trace images on each one. The red light then pull together and liquefy in an indentation below. The closer I get, the more agitated the red pool becomes. The images both show massed electronic life forms. The first shows the life absorbing in power. Thank you, suit lady. Jeez. The first shows a life form absorbing the power to break free from its shackles. The second shows it hiding from its captors. Ooh. Place hand on life on breaking free. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Let's just... Are we helping or hindering them? Suit lady, I have got the message, I swear. The red liquid surges into my exosuit. It materializes into a technology blueprint. Are you just going to keep saying that? Is it because I, I was in a menu? Maybe? I left a single life on here. Notes. Makes art with sticks. Makes you feel bad about shooting things that know how to make art. Um, Alright, so that was the regular doofer. Let's go back. Locate a portal, one Corvax casing, which I don't have on me, so. Good old hoarder, me. I've no doubt got one on my freighter. Alrighty. Let's have a little look. One Corvax casing. Nice. Let's try that again. Blah de blah de blah. Locator portal. One Corvax casing. Energy surge detected. Is anybody a fan of this church organ music? I know KJ doesn't like it. I'm not a fan either. A little bit piercing. Alright, 15 minutes. 
So let's just break Atmo. It's a little bit like the church cat is just sitting on the keyboard. Alrighty, here we go. Alright, let's do the do with the topping upping of the things with the stuff. Traveler capture loop enable. Anomaly event contained. The portal seems to beg me as I approach, demanding my attention. It requires me to activate it. It requires me to travel on. I'm unsure if I should listen. Activate portal. Now then, uh, before I die, let's quickly... Yes, yes, face ID, phone, thank you. Right, let's go to Captain Steve's planet. So, face, sun, wigwam... Y, Sun, Rocket Ship, Clips, Balloon, Bird, Scarab, uh, Whale, and Booty. Okay, have you been shooting me while I've been in the menu? Finally! Oh, god damn. Oh. Alrighty. Finally. We all died. Which no, just a bit with the dude dead in. Okay, nest revealed. Okay, um, maybe I'll do that when I come back. Oh, look at the ground here now. Wrecked. Alright, let's do it. Let's go get that fiendish row. stuff and things. Right, not everything is scannable, but... Uh, I always try to scan everything, because you never know, you end up knocking off kind of random scan mineral missions and stuff that's sitting in your inventory. Alrighty, we got a couple of beasties over here. Now, see if I can remember what Captain Steve said. I think he shot some, then he fed some. And eventually he did manage to get Fiendish Row. Okay, got the beastie scanned. Let's just throw all this on my freighter out the way for the moment so you can see exactly what we're collecting uh, and that one. Oh my goodness look how much I've got there damn it if I try to do that and shove that in there 
I always keep a hundred on you. Already. Uh, now, are they all running away from me? Is the question. Now, what happens if I... Actually, let's do the nice way first. Let's just feed one and see what happens. Oops. Excuse me. Ah, there you go. Exactly what I was talking about, just by feeding creatures. Mainly because I want something. Accidentally knocked off a mission as well. So what have I got? Fiendish row! Bang! First time, every time. All that time, I could not figure out how to get Fiendish Row, and it was pretty much staring me in the face. Now, I don't know how much Fiendish Row I need. Just in case. The last thing I want to do is not have enough to make a haunted pie. So, let's just grab a fair bit. I'd really been thinking um, I would have looked up the recipe for um, haunted pie in advance, but I didn't. That just sums up my whole play style. <laughs> Act, then think. Tell the it's hard to tell the, uh, the fauna from the flora. Imagine first contact with aliens would pretty much go like that. Excuse me, are you a person or a bush? I know that sounds racist, but... Oh. Already? I seem to have gone a bit quiet. Uh, does that mean he's... yes. Growth generation, okay. Um, how much have I got? 29. Oh, do you know what? I'm going to collect one more because it'll be just my luck. It'll be 30 fiendish row required. Okay, 32. Bonza. So props to Captain Steve for showing me where this was. A quick save, just in case. And um, now, actually, before we just dive straight back into the portal, let's just check out the system. Make sure there's nothing else worth fiddling with. Alrighty, so it looked like none of the other planets were um, really going to give me a dip blow, which is what I need next, so... Okay, so we're back. And, oh my goodness, these holes are still there. Right. Hopefully, nothing will come and attack me while I try to go to the next place. Now again, full props to the 
people on Reddit that um, upload Diplo locations because that's exactly what I'm relying on now. Okay, let's try this one. I should probably pull my table closer to me so I can read my phone screen at the same time. That would make sense, wouldn't it? Sentinels inbound, okay. As I stand before the portal, my breath feels hot within my lungs, a burning red deep within my chest. My suit is functioning correctly and reports everything to be normal, and yet that is not how I feel. Actually, the giant eggs we know we can get from the uh, from the um, expedition. But the Diplo chunks have eluded me for years. Um, already, look at a boat. Bird. TP. Y. Sunset. Deep face. Eclipse. Wigwam. Hex. Budgie. Boaty. TP. People call them all different names. Some people call the sunset the jellyfish. Some people call it a burger. Alright, please don't be a combo saying that there are no diplos. Come on, what do you say? GG, okay, cool. Ah, of course it is, as soon as I get here. Alrighty, what's up? So what do they say? I have a few combos. Dee's was here. Dee's who? Dee's nuts! <laughs> Hi from Canada. Enjoy your Diplo! Ah, oh, okay! Potentially confirmed Diplos? Ooh, what's that? What's that? What's that? That's a Diplo! That's a Diplo! Regularly sheds skin. Alright, now, as um, Captain Steve said in his video, if you feed them first, they give you one thing, and then if you kill them, they give you something else. Come on, take the food. Giant eggs times three. Alright, so finally I've got giant eggs knocked off my list. Alright, so what happens if I unfortunately kill this creature now? I don't like killing diplos, but I need my diplo chunks. Whoa, we went down easily. More died, diplo chunks. Fiendish row, diplo chunks, giant eggs, tick, tick, and tick. Just confirm. Diplo chunks. Uh, fiendish row, giant eggs. So, all I've got left to do now is make my haunted pie. Alright, let's hightail it back to my ship. Oh, which is, I know exactly where my ship is. No, don't tell me. I know exactly where my ship is. <laughs> it might be towards the portal. Alright. Let's make like bow peep and get the flock out of here. Ah, of course. It, a storm starts when I arrive and it ends just as I leave. Alrighty. So let's hop in my ship. Create a save. I wish you would do that, you know. You scared of the Jesus out of me. And save. Ready. 
Let's head to my little refectory. Or mess hall, if you will. I think this is <clears throat> on a on a freighter like this, it's probably a bit uh, grandiose to call it a refectory. It's probably more like a mess hall. Oops, wrong way. This is actually my little arboretum slash zoo. My refectory is this side. I should have known that. I put signs up to remind me which way things were. <laughs> All right, this is my little refectory. Little robotic kitchen, just making stuff. Got nutrient processors, little kitchenettes. People want to heat up their own lunch. And um, yes, those little yellow triangular stickers, that represents a holding pattern ready for when we can have windows on our freighter. I want this whole wall to be a window to outside. That would be nice, be like 10 forward. Anyway, final step. Make a haunted pie. Already. Um, now I know to make uh, a pie case I need flour and butter. So I don't know what kind of butter though. Okay. Hopefully, wild milk will do. Alrighty, so got cream. Now, that turns into churned butter. Hopefully, that's the right kind of butter. So, let's just go. Okay, got chin butter. Of course, I could still have just gone to Wayne's World's uh, website to look up these recipes. That, of course, I. Oh, yep, it'll make pastry. Yeah, sometimes I like to wing it just to, you know, roll the dice, see what happens. All right, so I've definitely got pastry, which means I don't think you need anything else. That just refines into a pie case, and that with a fiendish roll will make haunted pie. Haunted pie equals success. Okay, pastry done. Um, got some spare flour, but I'll put that back into ingredient storage for another day. Now, pastry plus... Uh, oh no, I've got to make a pie case first. All right, pie cases it is. All right, 21 pie cases. Now, just to make sure, yep, so that slot there where the haunted pie should go is still blank. Let's do it. Pie case plus fiendish row. Uh, oh, uh, other menu. Where's my fiendish row? Not happy, it's on my freighter. That's why I can't see it. Fiendish row, put that in my exosuit. Right, take two. Pie case plus fiendish row equals haunted pie, yes! Cool. Alright, I'm gonna put that into ingredient storage because um, who knows when I'll find fiendish row again. Keep those. Pop that in my exosuit. Ah, I was expecting a bit of a fanfare for finishing, but there you go. Haunted pie. So, this should be... I've just gone around in a circle. Complete. 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 And complete. Nice. That's me finished cooking all the cooking products in No Man's Sky. I would kind of just insert some music of my own here, but I can't be bothered. Uh, oh, convenient little save point. This is my uh, stellar cartography 
room. Great, isn't it? All right. Um, well, I think all that's left to do now is, um, yeah, maybe feed those pies to uh, Cronus. And get some nanites from it. The precious, precious nanites I need to upgrade my Royal Multi-Tool to S-Class. Alrighty. Let's just do that quickly. Good night, Space Gordon Ramsay. Now, please tell me you want a pie. Thank you. Creature pellets. Why would you want creature pellets when there's a pie to be had? Goodness gracious me. Unremarkable. It'd take me five years to make that pie. Bastard. All right. That looks like I've done all the haunted pies. Let's have a quick check. Now I was at 31 something, so that's 4,000 nanites for 21 haunted pies, which is nothing to be sniffed at. Um, all right, well, I guess there's nothing more to be done. I've uh, succeeded in cooking everything that is cookable in No Man's Sky. And I am... Uh, wrong button. I am just under 15,000 nanites away from being to upgrade my Royal Multi-Tool to S-Class. So, um, yeah, I may as well call it here. Thank you very much for joining me, folks. This was Vanguard's 2019 Cooking in No Man's Sky. If you like what you saw, please like, please subscribe, and I'll say ciao for now. See you later.